uh, early detection and frequent monitoring are crucial in the management of macular degeneration. Uh, we now have effective treatments for wet AMD and various large randomized clinical trials have shown that eyes that are picked up early in the course of disease with good vision are the ones that do best once they receive treatment. Therefore, the earlier we pick up disease, the better these eyes will fare. With this device, we're seeing lesions at an earlier stage really than we had uh, in the years past without the device. So we're picking up lesions at an extremely early stage. Patients are getting treated at an extremely early stage. And by and large, those patients who are treated early have stable vision and haven't experienced decline in vision. So we're picking things up uh, very, very early, earlier than we had seen before the device. Uh, many of my patients love using a home device because they want to be active in their disease management. They always ask, what more can I do to make sure that I protect my eyes? So they're very eager to do monitoring at home. It takes just a moment of their time every day, and most of my patients are very grateful to have that extra safety net for early detection. Um, the 4C Home has numerous advantages over using an Amsler grid. Uh, first of all, the test is reproducible and not subject to patient interpretation. It's highly reliable. Also, we can monitor patients' compliance. We can tell whether a patient is actually doing the test on a daily basis versus not. And if they're not, we can send them a gentle reminder uh, of the importance of daily monitoring. Uh, the ideal patient for using the 4C home uh, is that patient with a very high risk for conversion from dry to wet macular degeneration. Those patients with wet AMD in one eye already and dry AMD in the other eye are at highest risk. So these are the patients that I uh, encourage the most to use the 4C home to monitor their better eye, the eye with dry AMD. The 4C home device is used to augment our ability to monitor for the conversion of dry to wet macular degeneration. Patients still come in for their regular visits as frequently as they would normally, but as a physician we're able to monitor them at home uh, to make sure that there's no change, and if there is one, we bring them in right away to make sure there isn't a problem, and this allows for early detection of wet AMD. From a doctor's perspective, it's quite straightforward. We can look at their progress online uh, with a simple login and password. Um, and even if we're not checking the online site as, uh, on a daily basis, the company will notify us if there's an alert. So from the physician's standpoint, uh, it's not a significant investment of my time uh, during my busy day, but I am able to ensure that patients are getting the care that they need.